Administrator for Lincoln County Children and Youth, and Aaron Moyer. Um, I'm here today to present um, fiscal year 2019-2020 service contracts, as well as a contract for Mid-Atlantic Youth Services. And in addition to what was on the memo, I also wanted to present the CWIS data sharing agreement. Um, so first, service contracts for fiscal year 2019-2020. Um, we have 33 contracts for your approval. Of those contracts, 21 providers have not requested any increases. Um, the increases that were requested are within our budgeted amounts. The larger increases um, are either covered through CCIS, which is the Child Care Information System, as well as medical assistance at no cost to the agency. Um, I move for your approval of those contracts. I'll make a motion to approve the new provider contracts as uh, provided to us. And I'll second that motion. It's been moved and seconded. Any comment or question? Hearing none, all in favor, please indicate by saying aye. 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 Both same sign, so moved. Um, next up, I have the provider contract for Mid Atlantic Youth Services. Um, and this is actually an addendum to our previous contract, but being so close to the new um, fiscal year, we just added it onto the new contract. Um, so for them, they have on their contract a one-to-one -one staffing, so one staff to one client, um, and that is $568 a day, and a two-to-one staffing, so two staff to one client, and that is $852 a day. Um, what was that number? $852 a day. And I just want to put this out there that this contract is specifically for one child, one very um, high need child at this point in time. Um, and we are constantly monitoring the staffing there um, to determine if she can be reduced to the lower level. Um, she currently is on a one-to-one -one staffing, um, and if she does well on that, then they would reduce her to the traditional open residential, which is reduced then to $270 a day. So we are hopeful that this can occur. Um, I ask that you approve the contract for Mid Atlantic. And this is the one that has been going on for the last couple of weeks? Yes, that is correct. Uh, also move. Also it. It's been moved and seconded. Any comment or question? Thank you for your uh, ability to stay with us and uh, to make the best of a, a very difficult situation. Since the, you're new to the position, uh, keep smiling. We appreciate that. <laughs> it's a very tough. Uh, job you have, and this is a, an exception to that, even more so. Um, yes. um, the last thing I have for you... We, we have to, oh, sorry. All sorry. in favor, please indicate by saying aye. 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 Close same sign, so move. Now you go ahead. Thank you. Sorry. Um, yes. Yes. <laughs> Next I have is the CWIS data sharing agreement. This is to be in effect from October 2019 to September of 2020. This agreement is the same that it has been in years past. CWIS is our statewide system that houses all of our child abuse cases so that we can share information from county to county and we can monitor cases. Um, I ask that you approve the CWIS data sharing agreement. Do you I'll have an vote. amount for that? There is no cost to this. Make a motion that we uh, approve the data sharing agreement as uh, provided. Second. It's approved and second. Any questions? Comments? If not, all in favor, please indicate by saying aye. 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 Opposed? Same signs? So moved. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Keep up the good work. Thanks. Thank you.